What is up you guys? Welcome and welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Najima and if you've been here before, what's up? Welcome back. So as you can see, my hair is looking really dull, really dry, and it's been like this for a good minute. So I'm about to do something that I learned back in cosmetology school, which is called a clear gloss or a clear rinse. And I'm just gonna be using the Adore brand in color Crystal Clear. So basically what it does is it gives your hair a nice luster, a nice shine, gets your hair from looking so dull. And so that's what we're gonna be doing today. And I'm also going to be blow drying with the red air. So first things first, I have to get this hair really nice and clean. So I'm hopping right into the shower and shampooing with the Anomaly Clarifying Shampoo. So now that our hair is all clean, we're gonna go ahead and get started applying the rinse or the gloss. So now when we're applying it, we're just gonna focus on getting it on the mid shaft and the ends. We're not gonna put it on our scalp, but we just wanna make sure that we do get it all over and get it on every strand. Now that I have it all applied and worked in, I'm gonna go ahead and put a shower cap on and go sit under the dryer for about 20, 25 minutes. And now these are the results before deep conditioning. I don't know if you guys can see the difference, but I definitely can. And now I'm just applying this Apogee Reconstructorizer and some serum in my hair and just really working that in and making sure it's all really nice and detangled so that we can go ahead and use the Rev Air. If you guys want a tutorial on the Rev Air and my thoughts on it, I definitely have a video coming out this week, so be on the lookout for that. Rever gets it done really quick. As you can see, it was less than 20 minutes. And so I thought that I was gonna be done for the night and I threw my hair up in a bun and I thought I was gonna call it a night. But no, I had to come back and I had to try to curl it. But do you guys see that shine? Do you see how pretty that shine is? Now, this is where things started to get a little shaky. Um, I'm not gonna lie, these curls were giving Grand Grand, like they weren't giving what I needed them to give, they were giving James Brown, like, I tried to do, I tried to fix it, I tried to save it, I tried to do the little 70s little zhush thing and I just ended up looking like this guy. So yeah, I, I don't know what was going on, <laughs> it, it just wasn't working, I could not save it. I mean, this was, it was okay, but like I said, it was giving like... It was giving like your grandmama back in the day. So I just called it a night again, threw my hair back up in a bun again, and you know, I called it a night. But then again, I came back and I did some flexi rods. I couldn't, I just could not take an L like that. So I tried to do some flexi rods and this is the next morning me taking them out. Now the curls, they were kind of cute. Like look at the look at the color in the curls. Like they were kind of cute. Um, like I said, it just it was kind of giving grand grand. I don't know. I have mixed feelings about it. It's like it was cute, but at the same time it was kind of I don't know. But I mean, my hair looks nice and healthy. Look at the color. Look at the shine. It looks really like the back looks really good. So I don't know. Do you guys think it was a fail or not? Let me know in the comments. 